Hey guys, so I've just pushed Pete out of the road here for a second. I've just come out to check this out and the guys are doing an amazing job as per usual and it's something we just don't show enough. So I just wanted to take you behind the scenes of what happens because there's so much work that happens in this shop that just literally nobody ever sees. So um, the guys have gone and built a, a big plate here to go into this Y62 with all of the airbag stuff. So we've got the manifold, we've got airbag controls, um, an air pressure control for the air outlet as well for up here. So just this stuff, you just we really don't show showcase it enough. The amount of effort that the guys go into, to not just the stuff that you can see, but all of the foundation stuff that goes behind plastic panels that nobody's ever going to see. But it, if we head over to this draw system we're building over here, you'll get to see more of exactly what I'm talking about. So this is a new draw system that we're doing. This is for um, wagons. It should fit. Um, Y62 and 200 series cruisers. So we've just got the small drawer, stainless steel bench top here, um, and an Evercool fridge. That's not really what I wanna show you. What I really wanna show you is the work that the guys put in behind the scenes. So Tim's been building this battery system. We've got the big 200 amp and a drive. We've got all our big cabling to suit the inverter and all the power that's coming in and out. <clears throat> we've got this panel here with all of the um, inverter controller and our power input. So that's mains power input. And then on this side is where, you know, the brains of the operations happening. So we've got our DC charger, we've got our inverter charger. So this one's the new one from Enerdrive, 2000 watt um, output with an 80 amp charger all in one package. And we've got our 50 amp Cymarine shunt in here as well. So we've got um, this monitoring DC charger, we've got it monitoring the fridge and we've got it monitoring the accessories which is the fuse panel just underneath here. As you can see all of this is all terminated, heat shrink, sleeving, this is all pre-wired ready for the um, compressor to hook up. Where the wing panel is here we've got all our cables pre-terminated so that this wing panel can just get installed and plug straight in for all your accessory sockets and all that sort of stuff. So as much as, you know, everybody's quote might read, you know, Enerdrive battery, DC charger and inverter, it's all the same gear. The real difference comes down to the standard of gear that's being used um, outside of that and the quality and the standard at which it's being installed. And a lot of this stuff you'll never see. There's wiring in behind here that will put a, a shot up of what that looks like. You, you, nobody's ever gonna see this stuff but the standard that, and the way in which that is done is really what determines how effective and how reliable a battery system is going to be. So again, that's the crux of it. I just really wanted to, to take a second to show you behind the scenes what happens. You get to see the pretty facade and all the stuff that's on the, on the outside, but fundamentally it's what's on the inside, the stuff you can't see that matters the most.